praise the Lord. Well, this is our service. Feel well, free to testify. We our service is what we make it. Praise so, bringing in my you have a praise for the Lord. Stand up and praise Him. Praise the Lord. Amen. I have a praise that He my soul this morning to the Lord. Truly, I thank Him for saving me, and I'm just so happy tonight. As Brother Coleman told you, last night my cousin was here, and he's a Jehovah Witness. And I mean, when we hear what they believe, which and they have no promises, nothing. They don't even believe in healing of the body. They believe that the devil healed you. If you're healed, that, that's a trick of the devil. And how today, the people are so very much deceived that, I mean, I have, we have a terrible burden for him and for all those people that are lost. But yet in my soul is a praise and a great joy in my soul for the truth that, that the Lord has seen fit to reveal to us, his people, that he is alive today and that he's healing people and that there's a, a fountain filled with blood that flows from Calvary. It's a, that I know that in this morning and that I can stand here and lift my voice up to him. You would say, Elaine, what are you so happy? You don't have any money. You, you, oh, I can name a lot of things I don't have. But thanks <laughs> be to God, I got Jesus on board this morning. And I, and I know that my father is richer than any millionaire in the world. Amen. And that I'm an heir to that kingdom. There's no doubt about it. Nobody can come and take my place this morning. And that's why I, I want to tell you about it, folks, because I'm a child of the king this morning. I'm bringing it in my soul. I feel good. I'm telling, I feel like taking off here this morning. Glory be to God. I, yes, I'm getting emotional. I feel good. That's all I can tell you. He just flooded my soul because there's people. I said, Lord, me. Why me, Lord? I said, Lord, let me just be conscious of what you've done to me. So often that you, we get these wonderful blessings and we just say, oh, well, yes, we're saved. But this morning, I want the world to know. Amen. The world is in God and he has chosen to call us out. Glory. And the Lord is blessing. Even last night, an elder came here from one of the denominational churches. And there are people, folks, that are hungry for the word. Yes. He has heard that word and he's hungering for it. Yes. And when I see that appetite in him as we yes. looked at him, and oh, glory to God, how we must pray for these people that they might yes. be born, and sheep. Yes. How he had that taste and how when Brother Hunt and Brother Coleman was giving out the word through the Spirit of the Lord, how he was eating that word. And a little young man, his name is Abraham, was here. I, I would like for everyone to pray for them uh, by the grace of God is, is that they would even hunger more, that God would put a more thirst in them for the word. They actually admitted that they just don't have any word in the church. There's nothing there. And how when they hear this little word, how, how they're just feeding on it. And how, oh my, as Brother Coleman says, <laughs> how those muscles just begin to start to grow. Yeah. <laughs> Lord, I'm, I'm happy this morning. I, you can say anything you want about me, but Sister Coleman needs to go on. She's a child of the king. Lord, washing his blood. Oh my. There are many for Many. God knows. You can Point them out all day. Probably take you two, three years to name them. But glory to God, by the grace of God, who died for me. Oh, he's going to cleanse me. And he's going to make me ready to get away from this place. Oh, God. I can run away. Oh, pray for me, children. I want to make it. There's nothing here. Nothing. Just for all but what he's got laid up for me. My heart is still. It's just overflowing with praise for him. Oh, my. I pray that we all will be overcome. That none will have to stay here in this, this world that's void of anything. Because it's going to be desolate before any before soon, I believe that. So pray much for me that I might please, please the Lord and I might be in his will in this last and evil day when oh God, the devil goes around just like roaring if he's got my family, this my cousins, how he's got them deceived, believing a lie that God is not alive, that he doesn't heal. When we we all sit here knowing that we're healed by him daily and how can they take that testimony from us they cannot. So let us pray for those in darkness this morning, and let us praise the Lord. Amen. Praise the Lord. Thank you, Jesus.